Okay, here's a little update. Got almost all the perimeter, or almost the whole enclosure for the batteries. Got a little uh, steel bar, three quarter inch by a quarter inch. So we got to the top part still. And then I'm going to be using these brackets to mount it to the, to the car just like that. One on each side. That should be fine. Alright guys, here's a little view with the batteries in. I just took the extra tire out with the batteries in. So it does come out with everything in. And the floor will just come off just as easy. So I really wanted to have that. So I got some framing down here to make it uh, more stable. So we're gonna put a piece over this. This will go right here. And then we'll put the amps on top. And this is gonna come out to give some more space. Here's your view with the uh, steel bracing to make sure that shit don't come out, it don't slide back. So that's looking. All right, here we got part of the rest of the floor. I still need to make a little piece right here with some cardboard. And then I'll put a mounting br bracket on the bottom and then uh, just uh, screw it in together, make it one piece. And then I'm gonna carpet the whole top with some black sway or whatever I can get. And then I'm gonna carpet this part too, or upholstery it. Just like the whole floor, so I feel a little better about it. And then I was gonna make it just a hole to put the ground through, but then I'd, I would have to take off the ground if I, if I want to take this off, so I really, I'd just notch this all off so I could just take this off without with the grounds. So you gotta work smarter, not harder, like the XO says. I'm gonna put a grommet around all that so all the sharp edges won't fuck up with the wire. We got through the ground right here. I'm waiting on some wire from. John Ray by Sky High. Some Tuat. So, should be coming in soon. So, now I'm just gonna make that little piece right here. And then I gotta go get some fucking mounting plates. Those flat ones. Put two, swing on each side. Just so it's one piece. And then, like I said, I'm just gonna carpet the whole top. And then I think I'm just gonna leave the sides like that. Not really a big deal. But, um, yeah. It's coming along pretty good. So now I just gotta glue this whole shit together, the box. I'm gonna leave this part separate. I'm just gonna screw it in but not glue it. Cause I wanna be able to take it off. That way the batteries are easier to take out. Instead of having to fucking just pull them straight through, I'll just take off the top part. I could just like, you know, pull them up or whatever. Easier. So the back piece is over there. So I used half inch for the back and the top. So I would have some more room to push it back and for the amps to sit lower and the sides I just I just use the uh, three quarter so I can put the screws in and they wouldn't penetrate the uh, battery. Put some simple brackets to hold on the uh, the, the fucking uh, seal brace so they won't slide back. And I'm gonna be putting some those brackets on the floor.
All right, so here's what I did today. I'll show you guys. I got that bracket in, just with one screw holding it down. We got this bracket for the uh, uh, steel to hold the batteries in place. This side, looks nice and stable. Batteries over there. So I'm gonna work on the amp rack. In the meantime, while this is there. Okay guys, gotta go get some threaded rod. Some tiny ass one for the for the amps because I'm gonna stack them. I'm gonna stack two amps. You guys will see when they come in. We got this piece. Hey okay guys, that's the end of this part. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it and uh, stay tuned. Peace out. <laughs>